Yo, what's up everybody? Happy Sunday today. Today's a very special day because today is going to be a first time going to a Raiders game. That's right. We just got our landscaping almost ready and approved. We got it submitted, so I think we're going to get that approved through the HOA. I can't wait to show you exactly what we're going to do to the front. The Jeep, believe it or not, the Jeep is actually... The battery's dead. I got to take the car in. As you can see, it is like completely dirty. Why do we have a violation here? Parking in front of the driveway? Are you freaking serious? It's my own driveway. Wait, you, you, you cannot park in front of your own driveway? I don't know. I am going to have to talk to the HOA. This is crazy. Now, before we head over to the Raiders game, I have to stop by this condo for a second here because this condo has been on the market. We have not sold this condo whatsoever. And the condition of the condo looks like crap. Now, here's the thing. We purchased the property for $200,000. A couple months ago, the property was worth about two forty. dollars I thought I could dump it. It's listed now at $210,000. This thing is not moving. So now, I got to meet up with Colin, the painter, and we're gonna have to probably rehab on this home in order to move this unit. However, I may be taking a loss on this deal, which sucks, but that's part of real estate investing. So this is it right here, man. What do you think? Not bad. Just some cosmetics. Do you smell it? Smoke? Yeah. Changing the carpet? I'm gonna have to probably. That's I don't want the, That's where the stains stays. See that? Oh, I don't know. Oh, this is like a, yeah, it's like wrapped. Yeah. Like that vinyl sheet over it. I don't know if we could actually um, sand it and sketch it. I mean, uh, etch it, then yeah. paint it. And I think these uh, rocker switches are pretty old, so. Changing them all. Yeah, so they just probably have to uh, come out because it's just kind of old. Yeah. This panel can come out, but because this is screwed into it, it normally just hangs on the wall. Yeah. And then we'll put it back. Um, He's like, it's poo -poo. He knows what that is. So what I'm thinking is, uh, if you can have you guys scrape all this off, mm -hmm. sand this down, then we'll paint this white. Just the tub. Just the tub. Okay. Then we'll have yeah, to. Yeah, we can. We can always come back for just the tub if we need to. Yeah. So uh, this, this, the doors. All right, guys. I know you guys want to check out the Raiders Stadium. However, we got one more pit stop. Now, here's the thing. I don't watch football whatsoever. However, this is gonna be my first time going to a Raiders football game. Now, I've gone to a football game once, and that was actually in Phoenix, and it was Cardinals versus uh, Detroit Lions. Ironically enough, this game that we are going to, it's Cardinals versus the Raiders. Now, to make this more fun and exciting, we're gonna stop by here at the South Point to place a bet. All right, this is actually uh, pretty overwhelming. I have no clue on how to gamble or even bet on this sports thing. So basically, what I'm doing is I'm betting $200 to win a total of $181, and I'm giving Arizona five and a half points. So that means I gotta win by five and a half points to make $181 to bet. So does that make sense? I bet 200 to make 181, but I'm giving five and a half points. That's basically what it is, I guess. I have no clue what the hell I'm doing. However, I wanna try to make this more fun and exciting. Now let's go to the stadium and let's check this thing out. Man, this is insane. The only thing about this stadium is that there's literally no parking. However, all these businesses right here is making so much money. We literally parked right here, it was 60 bucks. So thinking about buying a commercial property over here, during the games, these guys are racking in 60, 60, 60, 60, 60. 
That's a lot of money, it's crazy. Time during game day, this bridge right here, the hacienda, they just close this off, and a lot of people park at the casinos and they walk this down this way. So beyond this point, you cannot have no bottles, no soda cans. You can only have a clear bag, certain size. So when you get in, here's the bag size. Made it. So the tickets are actually on the app as well. Oh, let's go to the official store, babe. Okay. All I know is that I really want to have what is it called? Uh, the permits, right, or something? Oh, the license. Yeah, I want to get me a licensing. Hey, if you guys have a licensing out here for two seats, I actually want it. Oh, look at this, babe. So regarding this helmet, I wanted to uh, purchase this helmet and take the helmet out and use it, but I decided to speak to the um, one of the workers here. They were saying that you can't take it out of the box. As soon as you take it out of the box, they won't let you take it into the stadium because it can be used as a weapon. However, now I gotta carry this thing, so I'm debating should I hold on to this or come back after the game, but the problem is that Apparently, what did they say? They make over a million dollars, right? Yes. They make over a million dollars in revenues and sales. So if they win today's game, all this may be sold out. So I'm debating, should I hold on to this or get it later? So I don't know if I should chance it or not. So with the snacks, we got some peanuts, two of these waters. Jessica got a hot dog, I think that was like three bucks. And I got one of these energy drinks. All this total was like $31, that's right. You know, if you guys come out here, it's gonna be pretty expensive. However, it's all about the experience for me. Um, I don't really care about the price, I just wanna have the experience, so. And also, hey, real quick, I would not be able to do this and be in the position that I'm in if it wasn't because of you guys, believe it or not. I'm so blessed and I just wanna say thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. I'm for real, for real, for real, for real. All right, man, so we, we have a, a fan here, one of the followers, man. Say what's up to everybody. What's up, everybody? Fred from San Diego, trying to move to Vegas. Hey, don't forget to call me, man. So, so. I appreciate you, be blessed now. Oh man, we're gonna keep going up. Burning the thighs. What up? Let's see what number? Oh, I think we should go down that way, man. Wrong way. Seems like every seat is actually a very good seat.
Stand up.
All right, guys, so we're just waiting for everybody to clear out before we take off. Unfortunately, we uh, lost the game and also lost some money. So uh, today, um, we spent roughly about, what, uh, 4 45 with all the merchandise, $30 for the food, parking was $60 for this event. Uh, we didn't have to pay the t for the ticket, so that was cool. And we um, did a $200 gamble at the casino. So the total spending for today for an event like this, uh, not including the seats, was $735. So if you guys haven't had a chance to uh, subscribe to the channel, go ahead and click that subscribe button. Also, if you guys want more video content like this, let, let us know in the comments below. Other than that, be blessed. Peace.